Hey everybody. Hey, Sam. Hi Sam. My name is Sam. Yes, um, when, I, when I say hey, you say okay. hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. Oh, wait, all right. I want that level of energy to grab. <laughs> in Texas, yeah. and I was asked to do poems that aren't, aren't really depressing. Fuck yeah. I know, so I went through and I found four. Uh, and most of them are about sucking dick, and, and most of them are really sad. I wrote this in the Yiddish woods a few days ago. It's super dumb. The prompt was, uh, it's like smelling for the first time. Right. <laughs> Eating cum is like smelling for the first time. Yes! It's like smelling something gross. Something you're embarrassed to say is gross though because someone made it who you love. <laughs> or at least no. Sort of. Like a quiche. A quiche made by someone you ostensibly know, sort of. And it may be, in fact, love. Perhaps a grandmother. That seems reasonable. A reasonable analogy. Eating cum is like smelling your grandmother's gross quiche. And it's a bizarre quiche, too. One that's made without eggs and whatever's laying about the house. And you can't, for the life of you, understand why this person would make this quiche and expect you to eat it. And you gag on the scent because they're looking at you, and you can't gag while they're looking at you with a weird expression on their face, which is nothing like a grandmother's. And the expression seems to say, yeah, what do you think of my smelly weird quiche, bitch? But you know that it's really hiding something like, I feel really inadequate about my baking skills. So you nod and smile and bottle stop. You know you pray and bottle Say yes, I came here for this, Grandma. I the continent of my old factory system for a scrap of that remarkable gift. There's no place in this whole world I'd rather be. Yeah.